Good afternoon, Pokemon fans. Welcome to another Playscape Games video. Today, we're in the wonderfully sunny and gorgeous Folkestone for a new store open. It's not every day a brand new, massive, multi-story uh, card game and board game store opens. We're in Folkestone for the opening of Chaos Cards. Many of you know, great place for online, for getting singles, um, all sorts of card games, board games, Yu-Gi-Oh, Pokemon, the whole lot. Um, really looking forward to going to check it out. They got uh, special events on there, it's Kent FM giving giveaways. Uh, yeah, really excited, let's go and have a look. So we're going inside the store now. Yeah. Good to see you man, good to see you. Thank you. <laughs> so we got loads of stuff right as they come in. Magic the Gathering, Netrunner, all these board games. Of course the Pokemon goodies that we all love, brand new Sizeberry Xboxes, Mimikyu Pinbox, the whole, the whole lot of them. Let's see what we've got over here. Massive selection of tins. I don't think I've seen so many different tins all in one place before. Including the new Sol Galeo and Lunana tins. Really good prices as well. Pikachu tins and even ones as far back as like the old the old Rayquaza tins, Latias, Zygarde, look at that. Absolutely awesome. Over here just more Pokemon stuff, wall to wall goodies. Look at that. Elite trainer box, that's what got me started off the other day. Uh, the other month. Starting back into Pokemon. All, all that all that retro goodness absolutely love it absolutely love it Some new sun and moon trainer boxes blastoids evolutions so many more collection boxes gengar ex dragonite absolutely wonderful i'm going to be doing an opening of one of these uh new sun and moon collection tins soon keep an eye out for that so much more things kingdra Charizard boxes, look at that, great price. Brand new Mega Sharpedo box, Mega Camera Arts, even like the older stuff like Mega Morwell, Magina, really cool uh, EX premium collection boxes, really cool, really cool. Let's go and check out the rest of the store. Uh, look at these awesome Pokemon binders. Mega Rayquaza, so good. Oh, look at that, it's a great price. Pikachu! I've seen that one before, that's awesome. Look at all these cute plushes. Pikachu buff! Meow! <laughs> Even got a squishy Zygarde, so look at that. That's cool. Wall with pops. Every store needs pops all over the place. Look at these guys, look at these, look at these Star Wars masks. Oh, look at this stationery set. Isn't that the cutest pencil case you've ever seen, guys? Oh, playing some board games over here. Absolutely awesome. Here, the guys are playing uh, Magic the Gathering. That's awesome. We've got a little uh, tournament going on over here. I love those Chaos Cards playmats, they're awesome. Do you know what, I absolutely love your playmat, where did you get it from? You got it from Chaos Cards. And here, we've got my choice of sleeves. Dragon Shield. All about the uh, red pro mats, guys. All about the red pro mats. Game cases over this side. Oh, look at all these deck boxes, ultimate guards, cool binders at the bottom there. Over here, these guys are doing some Dungeons and Dragons. It's awesome to see. Some kind of tabletop goodies over here. <laughs> over here, it's got an absolutely massive library of board games. Board games as far as the eye can see. Uh, Korean Styles Destiny, one of my favourites, love it. Netrunner, Suicide Squad, Batman miniature game. We know someone who loves that. I think which ones have I played? So many games here. 
Munchkin, can't beat classic Munchkin. I haven't played Munchkin Foo though. Ah, wow, well, absolutely massive section just for X Wing. Look at that. X Wing's one of those games that I'd probably love if I got into it, but it's just so much time. Look at, look at the details on these ships. Super cool. Love that Millennium Falcon. I think I'll just take that. No, no, no. Not today. So, more Star Wars games. Let's see what we got over here. Ah, oh, Seven Wonders. Great title. Code names. Great game. Highly recommended. Was it? Can't beat Settlers of Catan. There's actually a Settlers of Catan Championships being played at the UK Games Expo in Birmingham next month. Ah, guys, guys over here playing some Yu-Gi-Oh! It's time to duel! There's, there's always one, isn't there? There's always one. I believe you missed about 17,000. Not Pokemon Monopoly guys, here we are, the real stuff. <laughs> no way, Family Guy Monopoly. That is awesome. King of Tokyo, great game, easy to learn, quick to play. Game heaven, absolutely wonderful. So, we're here with Simon, the events coordinator of the Chaos Cards Tabletop Gaming Centre. How's today gone for you, Simon? Uh, it's been fantastic today. We've had a really good response from the customers that have come in. They've loved the space, which has been awesome. Um, we've had players, we've had demos, we've had games, impromptu games. Um, from our point of view, it's exactly what we wanted it to be for a gaming centre where there wasn't anything sort of in folks and fine. So yeah, from our point of view, fantastic day. So before this place opened, what was there to, um, in terms of gaming areas and gaming centres in Folkestone? There were some very small shops um, which didn't really have the room that we've got um, and they haven't been here for a while so it's been quite, there's been nothing really for, for a few months and so yeah, opening up, it's just giving the space to people that, that, that were, uh, that really wanted it, so that's good. So what has there been going on today for your okay, opening day? So we have had a magic tournament, we have had uh, Test of Honour from Warlord Games, we have had X-Wing uh, X and Epic awesome. play, we've had Guild Ball, which has been awesome, we've had Tanks, we've had Gore Chosen from GW, we've had Cthulhu, we've had D&D, &D. Um, I'm trying to think if I'm forgetting anything. Oh, and we've had a load of board games, we've had uh, Code Names, we've had Ticket to Ride, we've had Cash and Guns, yep. Uh, I think that's the lot. Lo I might have missed something, but that was, yeah. Many games. Um, my, I myself am a Pokemon TCG player. What have you got coming up for uh, Pokemon players? Right, so we have a tournament tomorrow. Um, yep. um, a casual sort of get to know people. We're going to have a tournament, uh, Pokemon League starting. Weekly League? Yeah, weekly League. Fantastic. Starting next week but it might be the week after, but it will be shortly. And then we're going to have regular uh, events. So we, um, once we've got a few under our belt, we're going to have the- Challenges the, and cups. Challenges, the cups. We're going to have the, the pre-releases. The, pre the aim is to, to really support Pokemon full stop. Fantastic, and will you be supporting the other card games, Magic the Gathering, Yu-Gi-Oh, Vanguard? Yeah, pretty much if you want to play it and we can support it, we will do. So yeah, the other TCGs are definitely on the list. In fact, as I said, we had a Magic tournament today. And yeah, um, if you want it to play, we will we will get something organised. Right? Fantastic. And what's the grand plan for this um, store? Where where do you guys see each see see it in three years? Uh, we hope to see it massively used, busy all the time, and so a real destination for people to come and enjoy gaming. Somewhere where people can come together and enjoy the hobby we all love. Fantastic. Thank you very much. So we've got some Magic the Gathering players in an intense final at the moment. We've got 22 people for the casual tournament today. It was absolutely wonderful for any store opening. Hopefully, first of many uh, successful magic tournaments at uh, the new store. Very serious business at the moment. So, we're here with Tracy, the uh, store manager of the new Chaos Cards Tabletop Gaming Centre. How's the launch day gone for you, Tracy? It's 
it's been pretty, pretty crazy. Um, we've had a really steady influx of people playing games and, and browsing and buying. It hasn't quietened down until about about now, which is actually past what we were expecting to be our closing time, and we're still going. So it's been that good. It's been it's been phenomenal. So how, how did you get involved with Chaos Cards? I actually used to run a very very small version of this kind of store in Dover a couple of years ago, uh, which unfortunately I had to close down. But I bought some of my magic cards, through Chaos Cards, and when I told them I was closing down, they offered me a job doing their social media. Fantastic. And then here I am. Wonderful. So, what's the uh, grand plan for the store? What, where would you where do you see the store in three years? nice if we had a couple of other stores in other towns oh, fantastic, around, yeah. around the country. Um, Very ambitious, three years. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, it's probably a bit much, but you, you can hope. You can do it, you can um, do it. We would like to be running really big events like Magic Grand Prix, uh, X-Wing Regionals, that kind of thing. Pokemon League Carts, yeah, all, kind of all the stuff. Um, and um, we'd like to have a nice, uh, strong YouTube channel. Um, we've got a lovely games room that we can use to, to film things in now, so we'd like to really get on that and really make a thing of that. And, uh, yeah, just more of the same, really. Just to still be here, still doing the stuff that we love. And uh, we can see behind you, we've got the uh, massive board games library. How many board games would you say you have for sale, on, um, if you could guess? <laughs> well into the so my, what's your favourite board game that you'd recommend for a uh, for a new person uh, who doesn't play many board games but they want to try something that's not Monopoly or Scrabble? I would recommend something like Winter or my personal favourite at the moment is Manchies and Madness because I am a bit of a Lovecraft. Uh, Fantastic. Well, good luck with the uh, with the store, Tracy, and hope to see where it goes from here. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah, we just had an absolutely fantastic day at the uh, Chaos Cards Tabletop Gaming Centre. Met some awesome people, played some, played some great games of Pokemon, bought a few things, don't tell anyone though. And yeah, it was an absolutely wonderful day. Uh, if you're ever in, around in Folkestone, uh, the guys here, they're going to be doing lots more events and stuff. Well worth checking out. And yeah, um, make sure to like and subscribe this video if you enjoyed it. And stay tuned for more Playscape games stuff in the future.